Hey there, you are welcome to my YouTube channel. If you are wondering how many amperes are in a car battery, or maybe you would like to find out how many amps a car battery needs to start, this video is for you. The battery of your car is undoubtedly one of the most vital components. The car battery is manufactured with specifications for supplying the required current to kickstart the engine. The amperes in a car battery are also useful for powering all electronic gears, particularly when the engine is off. In this video, we elaborated on the following. Battery Ampere Ratings What is the amperage of a car battery? How many amps does a car battery put out? And how many amperes in 12 volts? But before we continue, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel, like, and share this video. Before we talk about how many amperes are in a car battery, it is important first to discuss the ampere rating in the battery amp hours chart. To know what an amp is a car battery, you need to know the ampere rating. The ampere rating is the electrical storage capacity a car battery can hold up. The ampere rating frequently ranges from 550 to 1000 amperes. However, the car battery size and type would be considered when viewing this range. To know your car battery performance in terms of amperage ratings, you must check out cranking amperes and cold cranking amperes. The cranking ampere and the cold cranking amperes are the two major battery ratings. The cranking ampere rating is the current supplied by the battery to start the car's engine at 320F for 30 seconds at 1.2 volts for each cell. This is the specification required by the engine to start the car under normal weather conditions. The cold cranking amperes rating is the rating of your car battery cranking ability at 40F for about 30 seconds at 1.2 volts for each cell, being the power mandated by the engine to launch the car during cold weather conditions. The size of your vehicle shouldn't be considered when choosing a car battery. Instead, check the total amount of electrical components in your car. The battery ampere hours chart is typically set up with deep cycle batteries. The rate of a battery is 100 amp hours signifying it can supply 5 amps for a whole 20 hours. The 200 a car battery can uphold a 10 amp draw for nearly 20 hours before it reaches 100% depth of discharge. This means you have to multiply 10 amps by 20 hours to get the amp hours, which is 200 a. This implies that a 200 a battery can last 4 hours with a 50 amp draw. However, this doesn't apply in most cases because the battery's capacity decreases as the load increases. How many amperes in a car battery? It's all dependent on the car battery of your vehicle. For every car battery, there is a rating. Others can supply as much as 1000 amps in a short time. What is the amperage of a car battery? A typical car battery has a capacity of around 48 amp hours, which is approximately 2 days. When optimally charged, a car battery supplies 1 amp for 48 hours, 2 amps for 24 hours, and 8 amps for 6 hours. The electrical components of your vehicle mount loads imposed on your battery. A completely charged battery should be able to work the starter for about 10 minutes, or the headlights for 8 hours, and a heated rear window for 12 hours. As the battery gradually approaches full discharge, the lights steadily dim before going out. How many amps does a car battery put out? The usual procedure entails a car battery requiring a stable running charge or even a low voltage of approximately 25% to prevent it from discharging. Based on this, any charger with top delivery of amperes per hour will be able to execute charging functions to best and may only take a maximum of 2 hours. Considering a conditional procedure, the results and expectations are quite different. From 12.2 volts and 12.9 volts is proper for car battery charging, but charging at 12.9 volts can result in a slow load, which is considered generally safe. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel, like, and turn on the notification bell to get notified when I post a new video. The threshold of around 15 volts is a wave for caution as though this can be a ground for charging, still, if these levels are not in closeness for supervision, it can overcharge. The range for optimal charging load appears to be around the thresholds between 13.6 volts and 13.8 volts in energy. It requires less monitoring but does support it still. How many amperes in a 12 volt car battery? The battery may have to be charged to full capacity to know how many amperes in a 12 volt car battery. A 12 volt car battery has a capacity of 48 Ah, and this implies that when charged to maximum capacity, the battery can supply 1 amp for 48 hours, 2 amps for 24 hours, and in that continuous fashion. 
How many amps does a car battery need to start? This question depends on the car model, voltage, ambient temperature, and engine size. In general, terms, starting a car battery can take an average value of between 400 and 1000 amps. How long will it take to charge a car battery? The car battery's capacity in amperes and hour and voltage should be taken into consideration to know how long it will take to charge a car battery. It will take 2 amps to charge a 12 volt slash 48 a car battery for 24 hours, 1 ampere for 48 hours or 8 amperes for 6 hours, and many more. In conclusion, the amperage for car batteries is available in a wide range, but the most commonly used types have between 40 and 120 amps. In a nutshell, bigger vehicles require more amperes and higher battery capacity than smaller cars. I hope this video has helped you discover how many amperes are in a car battery, what amp is in a car battery and how many amps a car battery can put out. This is all we've got in today's video. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel, like, and share this video. Thanks for watching. See you next time.